Now to our COVID-19 coverage. South Coast restaurants are allowed to open indoors at 50% capacity. Starting today, Santa Barbara County is in the even less restrictive orange tier of reopening. News Channel 3 reporter Scott Sheehan joins us now live on Milpa Street. And Scott, you talked to local restaurant owners for their reaction. Beth, I did, and if you're a taco or Mexican food fan, you were probably also out here ordering takeout for Taco Tuesday for one of these taquerias over here on Santa Barbara's east side. Now, the owners here on Milpas Street say that they're happy that more people can come inside to eat because they say when customers come in, they tend to, to order more. Santa Barbara restaurants can cook up more opportunities for their dining customers. Wednesday morning, the county moved into the less restrictive orange tier of the state reopenings plan, meaning 50% capacity indoors for restaurants. I can probably make more money and start to recover all the losses. It's for a full year, every week, last, last, last month. You can see more people walking around. They feel more comfortable now with the vaccines. I feel more comfortable to come and eat inside, and it's helping us out a lot. Some customers like Juan Aquino and his family are happy to see the expanded capacity. But they're not ready to visit a jam-packed restaurant quite yet. Half is perfect. It's slow. We need to take time. That's all. At Los Altos restaurant, the owner is taking a cautious safety first approach. He plans to keep requiring masks regardless of the guidelines that change at the state level. You know, after they say, oh, it's 100% uh, had a vaccine on, they have to wait. Because, you know, you know, this is really dangerous. The owner of Taqueria LBN Gusto hopes Santa Barbara County stays on the downward COVID trend and that business is good enough to allow her to hire more workers this summer. That we're going back to normal, yes. Yeah, I'm glad for that. Hopefully by the summer, everything's more clear and people are more comfortable to do everything. For many of those smaller taquerias, they say that Milpa Street is too busy and unsafe for them to build outdoor dining and parklets. So indoors is very important to them. And now they're looking forward to the least restrictive yellow tier and Cinco de Mayo. Live on Santa Barbara's east side, Scott Sheehan, News Channel 3. All right, thank you so much, Scott. Boy, that food looks good.